Hello and welcome to Gadget 360. Today I have with me the Realme GT. The Realme GT is a part of the new GT series of smartphones by Realme. Unlike the Realme GT Master Edition which focuses on design, the Realme GT focuses on raw power. And there's plenty of that with a Qualcomm Snapdragon 888 processor, 12 gigabytes of RAM and a 65 watt super dark charging system which Realme claims can charge the phone from 0 to 100 in approximately 35 minutes. Performance aside, there's also the racing inspired design which is aimed at the youth. So let's unbox this device and take a look at what's inside. But before I do that, I would recommend you head to the Gadget 360 YouTube channel and click on the bell icon so that you stay notified whenever we upload a new video. And here is the Realme GT. It's a typical box on the outside. It comes from Realme with a black finish. And so I'll put text on it. At the back there is the there are the quick specifications. Here is the Snapdragon 888 5G processor, a 65 watt super dark charger, it comes in the box, a 120 hertz super AMOLED display with 360 hertz touch sampling rate and a Sony 64 MP triple camera setup. Also this is the 12 GB RAM and 256 GB storage variant and it's in the racing yellow finish. So let's quickly take out the wrapper and see what's inside. Nothing on the back of the box. There's a box over here with the SIM ejector tool dare to leave branding and inside the box is a simple TPO case with the safety guide, quick guide and the regular stuff nothing else in the box here is the phone in the racing yellow edition we'll get back to that later but from the phone there's the 65 watt super dart charger and there is a charging cable and that's about it for the box here is the phone and there is this soft vegan leather finish on the back take out the sticker here you go let me quickly start up the phone and set it up And now that I have set up a device, let's take a closer look at the racing yellow finish of the Realme GT. The Realme GT is available in three finishes. There's a racing yellow finish which we received for review and there's also dashing silver and dashing blue. The racing yellow finish uses two materials for the back panel. There's a bright yellow vegan leather finish back with a polished black stripe that runs across it. The vegan leather coating feels a bit soft to touch but has a polycarbonate base under it. The frame is made of plastic. The power button is on the right side while the volume buttons are on the left side. The phone features stereo speakers with the earpiece doubling up as the second speaker. The 6.43 inch Super AMOLED panel packs in a 120Hz refresh rate and a 360Hz touch sampling rate which should come of use while gaming. There's also thin bezels all around the display. Moving to core hardware, Realme GT offers a Qualcomm Snapdragon 888 processor inside. The phone is available in 8GB and 12GB RAM variants with 128GB and 256GB of storage respectively. Pricing starts from Rs 37,999. The SIM tray has just two slots for two nano SIMs, so there's no room for storage expansion. The rear camera setup includes a 64 megapixel primary camera, an 8 megapixel ultra wide angle camera and a 2 megapixel macro camera. Selfie duties are handled by a 16 megapixel camera. There's a 4500 mAh battery which supports 65 watt fast charging and the Realme GT can also reverse charge accessories at 2.5 watts. Realme UI 2.0 runs the show on the Realme GT with Android 11 as the base. 
The software felt quite fluid during my initial use, but I noticed plenty of third-party apps that came pre-installed. After unboxing the device, it's clear that the Realme GT isn't a low-cost premium smartphone, which offers features like water resistance and wireless charging, but more of a gaming-oriented device with loads of raw power. So that was our quick unboxing and your first look at the Realme GT. What do you think about this smartphone? Let us know in the comment section below. And as always, for all things tech, stay tuned to Galaxy60.com.